And hey, well, this is Francisco from Wondershare Dr. Phone, and welcome to another video where we're going to help you resolve yet another technical issue in your life. Today's video is going to be about how to bypass the Android password through emergency calls. Now, all of us want to keep our smartphones secure from unauthorized users, and the best way to do this job is usually to add a screen lock. But what if you end up forgetting the screen lock and don't really know how to unlock the device? There are going to be different ways to bypass the Android lock screen that you can follow in order to unlock your Android device and access all of your files. So in this video, we're going to walk you through exactly how to do just that through some of these solutions so that you can also get access to your locked Android smartphone. But before that, do make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss any other videos moving forward. Now let's go ahead and dive right in. And now before we give away the solutions, we would like to point out that all of these methods are going to be applicable in different situations. So based on your specific requirements, you can choose the right method and bypass the Android lock screen to get the job done. Now with that said, we can begin by talking about the very first method. So the easiest way to unlock an Android device when you don't remember the screen lock password is going to be by using Dr. Phone Screen Unlock or Android. It is going to be a dedicated screen locker that's designed to remove different types of screen locks from an Android device. The tool is compatible with all Android versions, so it doesn't really matter which Android device you're using, Dr. Phone Screen Unlock will help you remove the screen lock and access your device within seconds. And since it is a full-scale screen unlocker, you can use Dr. Phone Screen Unlock to remove all kinds of screen locks, be it for for digit pins, passwords, patterns, and even fingerprints if need be. Now the cherry on top, of course, is that if you're using a Samsung or LG device, you will be able to bypass the screen lock without losing any data whatsoever. So you will be lucky if you happen to be using one of those. So if you're looking for a hassle-free solution to bypass the Android lock screen, Dr. Phone, Screen Unlock is going to be the right solution for you. So go ahead and follow these steps to unlock your Android device using Dr. Phone, Screen Unlock. So step one, is going to be, of course, to download and install Dr. Phone Toolkit on your computer and go ahead and select the screen unlock option that's going to be right on the toolkit or home screen. And now using a USB cable, go ahead and connect your Android device to your computer. And once this device gets recognized, go ahead and click on unlock Android screen. So on the next screen, just go ahead and use uh, the drop down menus to add your smartphone's manufacturer and device model. Just make sure you fill in all of that information as needed, uh, that it is as accurate as possible. Otherwise, you won't be able to unlock the device at all. And then go ahead and click on next in order to proceed further. Now follow the on-screen instructions in order to put your device in download mode, which are going to be, of course, readily available right there for you. And it's going to apply for you whether you have a smartphone with a home button or one without it. So at this point, uh, the tool will just automatically start downloading and installing the recovery package on your device as soon as it is placed in download mode. And then once the installation process completes, Dr. Phone Screen Unlock will begin the unlocking process and display a confirmation message on your screen to let you know that everything has been successfully done. Another working solution to bypass Android screen lock is to use the ADB tool. It's going to be a command line based software that you can use to control your Android device through your PC. Now, ideally, tech geeks use ADB to install custom ROMs on their devices, but there are going to be dedicated commands that you can use in order to unlock a locked smartphone as well. However, this method will only work if you have installed ADB on your system and USB debugging is enabled on your device. So do make sure to go ahead and enable that, of course. So here's going to be how you can bypass Android screen lock through ADB and unlock your smartphone. So step one is going to be to open the directory where you have installed ADB and right click in an empty space. Then tap open command prompt here to proceed further. So go ahead and grab a USB cable and connect your Android device to your system. Now you have to go onto the command prompt window and execute this command which is going to be as listed on the screen, but I'm going to title it out for you anyway. So this is going to be adb shell rm slash data slash system slash gesture dot key. As soon as you execute the set command, it'll just automatically delete the password file from your Android device and you'll be able to access it without any kind of hassle. So this is also a very simple way of unlocking the password on your Android device. Now, finally, you can also perform a hard reset on your Android device to bypass its screen lock. And this is going to be method number three. 
However, do make sure to keep this method as your last resort because resetting the device will erase all of your files from the device. Moreover, when you perform a hard reset, you will have to enter at the Google account credentials in order to unlock this device. So only proceed with this solution if you are willing to lose your personal data or if you don't care about it. And also remember the Google account credentials that are going to be used on this device because you will need them later on. So here's going to be a step-by-step -step process to bypass the Android lock screen by performing a factory reset. So first of all, go ahead and power off your device by pressing the power button. Now press and hold the power and volume down buttons together until the fast boot logo appears on your screen. So this is going to be all just depending on what kind of Android device you have. This one specifically applies to one that don't have a home button and then use the volume up and down keys to select wipe data slash factory reset and then go ahead and press the power button to select this option and for a few minutes while your android device automatically gets restored to the factory settings all you have to do is just wait a little bit and then once the process completes this device is going to restart automatically and then you can go ahead and proceed towards setting it up from scratch just as we mentioned earlier so let's go ahead and wrap up today's video on how to bypass android Android lock screens using different solutions. Again, do keep in mind that if you want to keep things simple, it would be better to use a professional tool such as Dr. Phone Screen Unlock for Android. It's going to allow you to remove uh, the different types of screen passwords within a few seconds. So if this video helped you unlock your smartphone, please make sure to drop us a like and even a comment down below to let us know how you feel or if you have any questions whatsoever. And to see more videos just like this in the future, do not forget to, to subscribe and click on that notification bell because it is going to be very important. Now with that said, this has been Francisco from Wonder Dr. Phone. Until next time, have a good one.